Hello everybody and welcome back to the Sunburn Islands and today we're going to be going off in pursuit of the Red Wool from the Dismal Dark Deep Dark Depths. So yeah that's what we're going to be doing. Um, I'm all packed up and ready to go. As far as I can see let's just go to the signs, get the map out, got some ender pearls with me, I've got some torch making gear, repaired the pick um, and everything else is good to go. So. Let's head out and begin our assault on this uh, penultimate place. Um, now, from what I've seen about this dungeon, this dungeon is very long and very hard. Um, and this is probably the hardest dungeon in the map. So, I will be paying very close attention to what I'm doing in this map. How's my armor doing? Not bad. So anyway, um, yeah. So we're almost at the end of, a, of this series. Um, I've already announced which maps I'm going to be doing after this one. That's going to be Sorry No Longer 2 and Mysterious Mainland uh, by Smith G. Um, I'm not sure in terms of which next Vex map I'm going to be doing. Um, it's going to be a while before I do any more Vex. Uh, I do have Waking Up, of course. That will be continuing as normal after this series. And I don't know what map I'll be doing next. Probably I will be doing um, the Black Desert 2 map. I'll probably do that one. That's just released in beta. I will probably play that when it's actually fully done. Um, because I know Vex intends to make a lot of changes to that. But in terms of another map, I'm not sure which one I will be doing yet. Uh, I haven't got much of an idea of what I want to do in terms of the next map. So I'll take a think about that one. But in the meantime, I've got two great mini maps and waking up as well. So there's going to be plenty to enjoy for everyone here. So I, I wouldn't get upset. <laughs> Uh, about the lack of Vex map content. Um, I've enjoyed this series up to now. It's been challenging. I know Vex says this is the one that would probably be best for a newbie. I would not recommend this map by a long shot because this air, this map has been very hard. It was harder than the Sea of Flame one I did. Um, it was harder than that one. But here we go. Um, the Obsidian Spires right here and we need to head for the central part here we go where this redstone torch is there we go right here so let's slow the boat down jump out of it no button man that's annoying to be honest I'm not going to need that door Let's get rid of that. Oh. Is that water down there? Well, we'll just have to see, won't we? Oh, it is. So, we, we got lucky there. That is water. Okay, so... Here is the dismal deep dark depths. We've got some diamonds. I'll collect those on the way out. Not too worried about them right now. Um, I just want to have a quick explore and see what I can see before we go adventuring off in any major directions. So we've got a tunnel here, tunnel there. There's lots of diamonds down this one, so let's explore this one. Looks as if it branches off here. Draw some skellies around, so let me get out of the water first, and that might be the nicest thing you can do for me. See some zombies. Well, a zombie and a spider. So there's some diamonds here. Is there anything off in the walls? I've never checked to see if there's anything in any of these walls. I don't think there is, but you never know. I, I heard something then. I don't know. Was it just me or... Was it... Did you hear it as well? I haven't been hearing it again. Maybe it was that spider. I don't know. Let me see. I need some cobble anyway to get out by the looks of things, so... Oh, there's a skeleton. I hear a skeleton. 
and a bat. So maybe we're on the right course. Um, I know this area is huge. Sounds like there's something this way. Oh, is there something above us? Hmm. Oh, there's a tunnel there. Or is that just where we've come from? I think that's just where we've come from. Oh, there's a creeper in there. At least it opened it up, I suppose. The creeper. Hmm. Here does not seem to be the, the place to be. Get out of here. What am I even doing? Just get rid of it. Uh, let's head back out here. Was this where we'd just been? Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Um... Oh no, it wasn't. It wasn't where I've just been. That was somewhere different. Hmm. Because so this is a dead end. So maybe we were in the right direction. Um, well, being as there's no monsters here, I might as well grab these diamonds. I can hear a skeleton around though. Well, let's just collect up some of these diamonds, because these are going to be very handy to have. I don't know if this is going to be the right place. Let's leave this place alone, I think. That would make the most sense. That doesn't look to be the right place. I think where we just were was the right place, personally. I just have a, a feeling that that area was the right place to go. How many diamonds have we got? 53? Nine. I'll go full stack, that will be enough. 63, 64, okay. Oh, I've got 64 and 1. Never mind. Alright, so... Got this sort of little beaten up area here. I know the entrance is back that way. I'd like to check out this place again. I don't know where... Oh, hello. I don't have much of a clue where I'm going. Or what I'm going to be doing here, but... I'll keep searching. Man, where are all the monsters? Ah. Hmm. Another dead end? Yeah, another dead end.
Or is it? Because I can hear skeletons. Hmm. Or is it this way? Or is that just that other place around here that we've just... Yeah, I think we've just been here. Yeah, we've just been here. A lot of experienced balls. Hmm. Watery based area. Oh, it goes up here. You know what? You blow up. Fine, be that way. Get out of here. This is probably the dungeon I cannot stand the most. These places I really don't like. I never have liked these confined areas. So this should be fun. <laughs> um, oh, gap here. Definitely something going on here. Hmm, spider out of the way. See you there. I have no idea where I'm going. I just presume this direction is the right one. Seems to be now we've left the water behind. Hmm, let's see. I'm taking a look from above to see if I can spy anything. I have no idea though. Um, but we'll see anyway. See what we can see. Hi, zombie. Don't mind me. Because I really don't fancy going down there. Get out of here, map. You just keep distracting me. Um, sorry I'm not talking a lot. Uh, There's just not a whole lot to talk about. There's not a lot of combat involved either here um, at the moment because I'm avoiding that. I know my armor is going to be vital towards the end. Where are we now? Hmm. A lot of creatures down there. Yeah, there is. So let's continue plodding in this direction. Which is hopefully going to be the right one. Though I can't see a whole lot from up here. There is something off in that direction. Light. I see light down there. Or is that just where I've just been? Or is that meaningful light? Who knows? Well, let's even get a better look at that. A little 
viewpoint here. Is that my, one of my torches or something more? I can't see. Yeah, that's one of my torches. So I've just been in a great big circle essentially. So wherever we Yeah, that's one of my torches, definitely. We've just been in a great big loop. Um So that's not proved to be one of my more successful endeavours. Um, I'm honestly not sure as to where to go now. Is this just another... Yeah, this is just another tunnel. This is where I was, near the entrance. Um, Alright, let's see. Right, okay, um... Let's see, let's get uh, some torches made here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back to the base and rethink my strategy. I have got enough diamonds out of here for the diamond block. So I would call that a victory. Um... Well, I think I'm going to have to rethink a bit here, because I have no idea where the wool is. Um, so, yeah, I'll be, uh, I'll head back to the base now, and I'll have a bit of a, a rethink as to how to approach this place. Because it's a big old bunch of messy old pathways, and just general disorganised junk around here at the moment. Well, this is the uh, near the entrance, I guess. But I have absolutely no idea where I'm going. So, that's probably what makes this area so challenging. Now then, is there a place to place any blocks? Or am I going to have to go down to the bottom? That'll do, won't it? surely let's head on out of here um, but at least I can make a full complement of diamond tools and stuff that will be handy bedrock man this place is huge hmm well, I wouldn't call that a successful mission, I would call that an unsuccessful mission, but at least we've got enough of the diamond block now. Raining. We're, we're part way to being complete. Part way, but still a long way away, unfortunately. Certainly a lot further away than what I would like to have been. Let's combine that bow, let's get my map back out so I can see where I'm actually going. can't even actually, can I take my, oh I can't take the gooey hood off. <sighs> um, so I'll have to rethink my strategy quite heavily for that area. I'll see, I may go back there in the next episode or we may go to the nether area and then return there for the last episode. I'll uh, have a think about that um, between this and the next one. But at least we got enough diamonds for the diamond block. Um, but that area you just can't navigate properly. There's just no indication of where to go. Unlike all the other dungeons, there's been a location. Or somewhere like a, a linear path to follow. That area reminds me of We All Float in Waking Up. But it's a lot easier to navigate that place is than We All Float. No, sorry. We All Float is a lot easier to navigate than that place. Um, it's just... It has no real order to it. We All Float had sort of like a linear path to it. Whereas this one doesn't so much have a linear path. This one's kind of just like dead confusing. 
and I have no idea of where I'm going to be going in there and I think it just gets confusing just seeing diamonds and stone all the time man I wish I'd have got a few more diamonds to get level 30 but never mind we can't have everything right so I uh, should be approaching the victory monument right now sure am I'll just head in here here we go Now the lost land there, and I can head inside. And let's uh, make up the diamond block. Um, of course, I need a crafting table for that, don't I? And a chest, that's for sure. Let's just grab this diamond block. So I've got that. I have plenty of torches. Um, stack those up. And I need a sign. I put the signs in here. Put the map away. So, diamond block. From the depths in round one. Gonna have a round two with that area. Um, but at least we managed to recover the diamond block. Um, just these two left now. Hopefully, in the next episode, I will either pursue the red wool again or I'll indeed go after the black wool in that nether based area. But uh, either way, we're, we're almost there now. I have all the blocks that are, the ore blocks that are required, and I have all of the wools apart from the last two. So yeah, um, what I'm probably going to do between this and the next episode is craft so, some diamond armor. Um, I'll go with this for now, but when that breaks, I'll put on the diamond armor. Um, and uh, yeah, so that is just about it. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I hope to see you next time. And until then, see you later and have a good day.